All right, in this problem, uh, we're looking at the stop quadrat regeneration survey method. Remember, the stop quadrat method is very flexible and it'll work for any species. All you really need to know is what your target stocking level is, how many free to grow acceptable species trees per acre that you want. And so uh, when we look at this, doesn't matter what the species is, once you have that, the math is going to be the same. And this is going to be very similar to some other problems that we've already done, looking at circular uh, fixed area plots. And so uh, what I want here is going to be uh, to know the, uh, let's see here, radius. So first I need to calculate the area. In order to know the radius of the plot, I have to calculate the area. So the nice thing about stock quadrat, your plot size is the inverse of your trees per acre in acreage. So if I want 150 trees per acre with a stock quadrat plot system, I want a 150th acre plot. So I simply need to convert this uh, to square feet now. So 43, 560 feet squared, or in one acre. I look at my units and they cancel out acres, acres. And so I'm left with square feet there. And in this particular case, 43,560 divided by 150 equals 290.4 feet squared. So now I know the area of the plot that I want. That's an area. So same process we've done before. We know area equals pi r squared. We have the area. We want the radius. Let's solve for r again. So I divide both sides of this equation by pi, area over pi equals r squared. I now have to get rid of the square on r, so I take the square root of both sides of the equation. So the square root of area over pi equals r. There's my equation. So now I plug in area right here. So I do 290.4, I divide it by pi, 3.14159. I get that number in my calculator. Then I take the square root of that number in my calculator. And if I do that order of operations correctly, the radius of these 150th acre plots will be 9.6 feet. The units on 290.4 were feet squared. I took the square root of it, which left me just feet. So that's my answer. You probably don't need to go to more than one decimal place on here. Um, a tenth of a foot is about an inch. You're installing these out in the field, out in the woods. You're not going to be realistically much more accurate than an inch uh, doing this with the uh, logger's tape or whatever other piece of measurement equipment that you have. So that's how you calculate the radius of a stock quadrat plot if all you're given is how many trees per acre you desire to be stocked in that sample.